guys, guys, oh my gosh. Now I know you're not gonna believe me, but I just got back from the VV-verse. I went to the VV-verse too, Batman. Just got back last week myself. No, the real VV-verse, not the one you tell your girls you went to. This was the real deal. And something amazing happened. I think I fell in love. Holy Batwing. Oh, here we go again. This time was different. Let me explain. You see, what had happened was, I was going back in time to fix a few crypto mistakes and some other mistakes I made with some women I was dating, you know? Just the usual things you do if you owned a time machine. And that's when it hit me. The light. I, I, I saw... It, it's, it's like it opened up my third eye. I knew I was in another time, in another place. It was so beautiful and amazing. Let me tell you guys, when I laid eyes on what I believed was the mythological vv verse, I couldn't help but think I had died and gone to digital heaven. I was flying around, checking the place out, looking for any signs of life. And I knew there was something or someone calling out to me. So I decided I need to park this kick-ass time machine and check the place out. See for myself what was up with the VV-verse. So there I was, walking around. The first thing I noticed is this badass looking car. I don't know what kind of car it was. I mean, it, it was pretty sweet. Not as cool as the time machine, of course, but it was pretty sweet. I knew somebody had to be here. I decided I'll start looking around through the windows, peeping the place out, see if I could see anybody in there. I mean, I wasn't trying to be creepy or anything, but well, now, now that I look back to it, it might have been a little creepy. But I, I knew I just had to get inside, check it out. That's not creepy, is it? So there I am inside, and that's when it happened. I saw the most beautiful girl I had ever seen in my life. It was like I was starstruck. Right away, I started telling her all about the Batcave and how where I come from, I'm the greatest superhero around. She seemed to be really interested in me. I mean, after all, what girl's not crazy about the Bat? Am I right? <laughs> So I knew that she was the girl of my dreams once she started telling me all about her car and how awesome it was, which made me really want to show her my car because, I mean, after all, I've got a kick-ass DeLorean that's turned into a time machine that I bought at a really great deal at the VV auction. So I knew it was getting late, so I hurried and showed my car off to her and told her that if she's lucky that one day Maybe she'll get the chance to come and check the bat cave out, as long as she promised not to touch my VV collectibles. And I knew from there that she was completely head over heels about me. I mean, she just really hated to see me go. But I told her I'd be back. Not to wait up for the bat. Bye, Batman. It was really great meeting you. I can't wait to check out your bat cave. I will miss you. That was the end of my trip to the VV verse, you guys. You believe me, right? The VV verse. Hey, forget you guys. I'm gonna make like a tree and get out of here. Oh boy, Batman, that was quite the story. Let's make like a tree hey, and wait, leave. Where are you Batman. going? Make like a tree and leave. Hey, come on, Batman. I believe you. Wait up, big guy. What's the matter, Batman? Can't handle any jokes. Oh, 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 oh. 